Dah dinner, bro. Depletes stamina and depleted stamina takes time to recover. Okay, let's take the route we planned. We're off to a statue of the seven. Which of the seven are you looking for exactly? gods actually answer you is a different story. You never know unless you try. So let's hop to it. Did you just feel the elements of the world? Seems all you had to do was just touch the statue and you got... As much as they may want it, people in this world can never get a hold of powers as... Uh-huh! If 
we keep heading west from here, we'll eventually... Mondstadt is the city of wind because they worship... So perhaps because you got... There are also lots of bards there, so perhaps one of them has heard news of your brother. Let's move then. The elements in this world responded to your prayers and Paimon thinks that's a lovely sign. you got from the Statue of the Seven! Aw, oh, Paimon's so jealous! Why doesn't Paimon get cool fighting powers? Don't be afraid. It's all right now. I'm back. Is he talking to a dragon? Thanks! 
Just what was that? Paimon thought we were gonna get eaten. Hmm. It definitely has something to do with that weirdo who was talking to the dragon. Yeah. Oh, what's that? There's some kind of shiny red... Let's go take a close. Be careful. Paimon doesn't have a good feeling about this. Paimon's never seen a stone like this before, so Paimon can't tell what it is. All Paimon knows is that it's dangerous. Best we put it away for now. Okay, we've got it. Now let's get out of here. May the Animo God protect you, stranger. I am Amber, outrider for the Knights of Favonius. You don't look like citizens of Mondstadt. Explain yourselves. Well, we're not looking for trouble. That's what all the troublemakers say. Doesn't sound like a local name to me. And this mascot, what's the deal with it? I mean, we've only been traveling partners for two months, but we've already become the very best of friends. So to sum it up, you're traveling partners, right? Well, look, there's been a large dragon sighted around Mondstadt recently. Best you get inside the city as soon as possible. It's not far from here. I'll escort you there. Oh, aren't you out here for some other reason? I am, but not to worry. I can keep you both safe while doing that too. Besides, I'm still not sure if I can trust you two just yet. Oh, uh, I'm sorry. Probably not something I should say as a knight. I give you my apologies, uh, strange yet respectable travelers. That sounded so fake! Do you have something against the type of language usage prescribed by the Knights of Havonius Handbook? Suspicious travelers, what are you doing in Mondstadt? She got separated from her brother during a really, really long journey. Paimon is her travel buddy, helping her to find her brother. Oh, looking for your family? Huh. my other stuff first, and then I can help you put up posters around the city. What exactly is it you need to finish doing first? It's simple. You'll understand in a bit.
too close to the city recently. My task this time is to clear out their... Camp. Bet you can't keep up with me! a little with your move. Thanks for the backup. How'd it feel? Now that you mention it, how is it the hilly trails ended up here? These creatures don't seem like the type to set up camps so close to cities like this. Exactly. It's more normal for them to be much further out in the wilderness. But because the dragon, Storm Terror, has been around a lot more recently, our orchards have been destroyed, and the local market has been affected as well. When the storms hit, we usually end up with at least a few injuries, so the Knights of Favonius have been tied up doing the best they can to defend the area. So these annoying creatures have been getting closer and closer to the city? Exactly. That said, clearing this camp helped make the area a little bit safer. Come with me. A responsible knight must make sure to see you to the city safely. Wow! These will come in handy. You can't keep up with me!
someone to chat to would be better than just standing around. Thank <laughs> you. 